When you add any kind of audio file to your project, be it narration or music, this is what you'll see. This is called a waveform, and it's a visual representation of all the frequencies of digital data that make up what we hear as sound. In Camtasia, this kind of mountain range looking thing is the default view. Personally, I find this view to be somewhat lacking in detail when it comes to making fine edits to my audio. That's probably because I'm also used to using higher-end audio editing programs like SoundForge or Adobe Audition or even Audacity where the waveform looks like this. This is called a mirrored waveform and it's used because you get two visual reference points to see the audio instead of just one, a peak and a valley instead of just the mountaintop. In Camtasia, you can actually turn this kind of audio view on or off by going to Edit, Preferences, and on the Program tab, checking the Mirror Waveform box. To switch back or turn it off, just uncheck the box. Like I mentioned, I prefer this view, but it's really a matter of personal preference. Some people love it, some people hate it, and they prefer the single view. That's up to you. Just be aware that the option does exist. Try them both and see which one you like best. One other quick tip for audio editing in Camtasia is that to see more of your waveform, it can be very useful at times to simply increase the height of your audio track by just hovering your mouse over the top of the track here or using the slider control here. Combine this with zooming in on the timeline and you'll get a nice big beefy view of your waveform so you can really get in there and do some fine editing. When you're finished, just slide them back down for a more compact view on the timeline. Hey, Lon Naylor here. Thanks for watching. Leave your questions and comments below. I answer all of them personally. And if you like this kind of content, consider subscribing and clicking the bell notification button so you don't miss anything. Thanks again, and I'll see you next time.